Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video and today we are playing F124, it's just come out so we're going to give you my first thoughts, my impressions, see what the game's like and then uh, yeah we'll go from there. If I sound a little bit dodgy today I've got a bit of a cold, I'm struggling if I'm being honest with you, really struggling. But, but what we're going to do, we're going to do just a quick race and uh, yeah we will go from there. Yeah, all right, Natalie, come on. Along the way, you'll build up your oh, it's all right, Natalie, come on. Ready, jump into the play screen and right, should we just chuck ourselves into a Grand Prix? Did we give it a name, please? Oh, we'll have a good look around. You need to hush tones, though. Right, should we just jump straight into a Grand Prix? And we'll see. We'll see. Let's pick a track that I'm good at. Let's pick a track I'm good at. Right, what we'll do is, I think Canada, we'll go Canada land, and we'll go in, we'll go in the McLaren, we'll be Lando, difficulty, let's play it safe, I need to work out what I need, so we'll go, what's, I'm going to start at 75, and we'll go from there, because last year shafted me. Oh, very sure. We'll do a five lap race and then we'll do another one and we'll see what the impressions are. Let's go. Welcome back to the circuit Gilles Villeneuve, where Stroll, Latifi and Villeneuve, both Jacques and Gilles, are the four Canadian point scorers in the past. Who's going to come out on top today at this favourite of the F1 calendar? It's the Canadian Grand Prix. If you want flat out racing, you've come to the right place this weekend as it's full throttle for 59% of this 2.7 mile circuit, peaking at around 210 miles per hour going into the final chicane. But that speed requires discipline and there are more than a few close walls here just waiting to punish drivers with a heavy right foot. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Charles Leclerc lines up on pole position, edging out Max Verstappen, who'll start from P2. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Sainz, Perez, Hamilton, Stroll, Russell, Norris, Oscar Piastri, Fernando Alonso, Ricardo, Ocon, Sargent, Albon, Bottas, Gasly, Hulkenberg, Magnussen, Sonoda, and Joe Guanyu. With preparations almost complete, let's head down to the track. And joining me in the commentary box today with the best view on what is about to unfold and some strong views on the action we're about to see, Naomi Schiff. I know what we've got to do. Right, we're just going to skip this because I just want to get straight to it. I just wanted to see if there was any newness, but there is not. Right, the car handling apparently has been massively overhauled. I've seen some clips online that apparently it's a bit wank, so we'll have a look. We'll see. Okay, pull the clutch in, hold it there until the start. Right, feed in the throttle, let's build the revs. Okay, clutch out, go, go, go! You're not technically allowed to speak to him, the old. That's a good start, I shall take that. Ignore the calamity that will unfold. So far, so good. We've got ourselves up into P5. We've got two Red Bulls ahead of us, plus the two Ferraris. So, we'll see what we can make it out. Oh, we've damaged a little bit of wing. We've damaged a little bit of wing. But this is just obviously our test race. Okay, so, ooh, brakes don't feel as good as they did last year. That might just be me. Do you know what? I think we might restart. Actually, what we'll do is we'll do... Let's see, I'm going to hit the wall again. Or, yes. Right, what we'll do is we'll restart... We'll have a clean slate. <clears throat> Fingers crossed, no damage. Right, come on. Oh, it's a thunderous start again, you see. And we're away well. Do not tag a car this time. A little bit of cheating, but that's fine. Let's stick it onto the pad. There's a bit of grip out here, actually. I won't lie. We'll need to get down by Perez. So I will take... 
<coughs> I'll take that. Oh, we're out wide again. Try and not lose our front wing on the back of Perez's car. So far, we are far superior than we were the first time round. Break a little bit earlier because obviously I don't think the brakes was good this year. I don't think they are. It took me a while to get back on the power there. We're going to get done by Stroll. No, not having that round the outside. Phenomenal behaviour. <clears throat> so anyone who's played this game, obviously the Champion Edition come out today. Um, quite recently, so if you have played it, let me know. Where you, oh my, there's a caution. There is a caution. We're not American. It's a yellow flag. Obviously, what are your first thoughts on the game? Because obviously the handling model looked weak when I first saw it. Although I believe that was just sim racers. Oh my days. Sim racers slamming it around with a wheel. So I don't know if that's really anything to go on. But I think obviously it's going to take a few, a fair bit of time to get used to it. But I'm fine with that. A little bit of grafting. I do plan obviously recording the career mode after this. So... We'll get straight into that after, but so far so good. Obviously, it's going to take a bit. I didn't play a lot of 22s, I just didn't like it. So, it'll be interesting to see how much joy I get out of this game. I probably will have to start with a fairly low difficulty, if you don't mind. I just only a Maui damn you one. If you want those enjoyable videos, I will put the difficulty on low. But no, I probably will have to start low and we'll work our way up because I have honestly I didn't really play much of 22 either, if I'm being honest with you. It's a game I want to get back really into because I mean I love F1. I used to absolutely adore playing the games. I, I rinse them for hours and hours. Obviously I've got adult life to contest with these days, but I do just want to get back into the game properly. Send Russell the other way. But so far, I don't think it's that bad. I know we're only two laps in. Now about to start our third lap. We're gonna try. I'm gonna try and go for a quick one. Come on. But so far, I don't think it's all that bad. I don't know if that was an update because I don't know what version. Because obviously, some people were given a game a few days early, but I don't. That, it still said work in progress on it, I believe. So I don't know if that was a preview build from say a couple of months ago. But we'll see. We'll see. So far, it's not too bad. Obviously, I wish they'd give the HUD a little go. People are cussing this out. It's not that bad. It really isn't that bad. People like to nitpick at things. Um, but as for me, I don't think it's too bad. It looks good. I think it looks really good. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing a career. Almost sent it round. That is going to allow George Russell. But he's going to have the DRS actually as well, isn't he? But we are going to, we've got a mountain of overtake at our disposable, disposable, disposal. And we have palmed off George from, oh, I keep messing this up. Oh, it's ferocious. Apologies, Piastri. That's actually a calamity down here. Right, couple of go. We will get some, some racing then after my absolute disaster. Obviously, this was never going to be Senna Donington 93. But, we will see. We will see how we progress over the coming months. A little bit of scrubbing. I ain't too serious over here when we play this as well. If I spin a car, go over it, right? Lovely stuff. We've got Russell up ahead. We've got Fernando up ahead. Can we catch them? The answer to that question is probably no. Also, I need to have a look, because you lot voted. I think we've got damage. Can't remember the buttons. I've changed gear. That's going to affect. Ooh, we're deep in. We're deep in. Ricardo's up high, and he could be unrealistic. That's fine. We are going to get a bit of DRS on Piastri. How OP is it? If we put the. Because uh, I heard this was a little bit OP. It is a little bit, isn't it? Getting used to the brakes is going to be an interesting task. But that's fine, that's what we're here for. I've already got 9%, so we're on the last lap. That's fine with me. Do you know what? I'm going to be honest with you. Impressions, the AI look alright. It's day one, remember. 
there's usually a patch within the first week to fix some of the little niggles but honestly it's not that bad if you ignore that the only thing bad is me but honestly it's fine it generally just is obviously I'll come with a better review once I've properly played it but this is obviously my first impressions of the game but I honestly it's not too bad the handling's fine it's going to take a bit of getting used to but that's fine I don't want to be able to be good straight away you want to be able to find the time like Chase and Stavis but I'm so far, I'm, I can see myself enjoying it. There seems to be a graft that needs to be in it. You can over-rotate the car as well, which is... It's decent. It's decent, and I will be doing it. I need to get used to um, out the corners as well, because I'm just planting the throttle. And I need to not do that. Charles Leclerc wins the Grand Prix. I think from science. I don't think it was very um, exciting at the front. That's the first time we've got turn one right. And we will come to the line. Lovely stuff. Do you know what? As well done, that was good. Yeah, good job, everyone. <laughs> um, good, good little couple points. Best we could do today. Go on, Lando. I like that's a nice little touch adding the radio messages in. But no, honestly, as in first places, first places as first King Charles. You know, a spin crafty for some of the things he says. But honestly, first impressions ago, I can see myself enjoying it. There's a career mode coming within the next couple of days, so make sure you keep an eye out for that. Obviously, all it was was a first impressions, and my first impressions are, I can get used to this. I definitely can. So if you uh, have enjoyed the video, remember to hit a thumbs up. There's going to be a lot of F124 content this year. I'm actually going to gun it. I'll put my head down and gun it this year. So yeah, if you've enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, and uh, yeah. I'll be back very shortly with uh, more content, possibly, maybe, sort of, at first.